previously on Redfall. And they got a blood sucker in the face. They all answer to it. We got him. Okay. Picked up Grim Tide Shotgun. Well, that's an upgrade. Collapsible shotgun unrivaled? Oh, it's an it. Uh, why do I have such a high-end shotgun already? What happened here? I mean, don't get me wrong, I am I am pleased, but but why? Killing enemy with weapon grants a 20% increased range for 8 seconds, 50% increased accuracy, 50% increased accuracy while moving. Definitely a good ambush weapon. Alright. Just get in there and blast them. It only has four rounds to it, though. Unfortunate. Anyway, let's go upstairs. Terrence Hunt. Mr. Boyer, am I right? I'm glad you're here. You'd be the only one. I don't want to think about what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I speak for everyone when I say thank you. My name is Terrence Hunt. I'm a doctor. Used to work at Redfall Regional. I'm taking care of everyone here. Sick, injured, and everything in between. If you need medical supplies, come to me. But only take as much as you need. There are other people here who need help just as much as you. All right, I mean, that's fair. Let me check this over. Yeah, you can just buy medical supplies for money. We have 2,000 uh, 2, coins. It's called support. I have 2,000 support. 2,000. Supply caches. Some of your allies in the fire station run supply caches where you can spend support to stock up on useful items like medical supplies, lock picks, rewire kits, and weapons. Check back occasionally since their inventory changes over time. You can earn support by collecting supply items or salvaging weapons. Right. So I can just go in here, you say, and then just kind of... We'll take a look at my weapons here. Like, I, I don't need all these handguns, right? I've got this centipede right here. That's the one equipped. So these ones over here, we can just kind of salvage them. We don't need those. We take those out. We get some money out of the deal. Let's see. Yeah, we got 252 for salvaging both of those. Not bad. Let me actually do that with uh, some of these shotguns, too. I'm going to keep one of these shotguns. Just because they all are the same, whereas Grimtide is not. But Grimtide has a smaller magazine, so we'll see how this goes. Maybe I'll like the larger mag more. I don't know. All right, next one is Ava. We need to go to Ava. Jacob, right? Well, I'm glad you're on our side. Huh. My name is Reverend Eva. Nice to meet you. Hi. Sorry it couldn't be under better circumstances. We were at the homeless shelter before this, but... Anyway, I do the organizing around here. Sending people for supply runs, scavenging, getting people to safety. Uh-huh. Sometimes they bring back useful stuff. Check the trunk from time to time. Whatever's in there is yours, if we can spare it. Okay. After this, new tattoo. Easy. Hey, I like where your head's at. Nice. Okay, check the trunk. Lost and found. Lock pick and rewire kit. Not going to buy any of those or not for now. We'll just kind of let them, you know, be as they are. Let's go Don't talk to Anna. Are you Anna? You are. Hold on. Let me look over this. You look like you, uh... Goodbye, Joe. Oh, said goodbye, Joe. Jesus. Jacob, huh? What's with the eye? Don't ask. And what's with the stomach, well, man? Leave my eye out of this. Are. I'm Anna, and this is my husband, Joe. You ran into one of those creeps, yeah? Only way to kill him is with a stake to the heart. Makes him pop like a firework. Yeah, I was there. Those loonies, you can take out with a regular gun, though. And we got plenty of those. This stake's free, but you gotta earn the guns out of my stash. Sorry. She's not sorry. I am sorry. Anyway. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. So anyway, I burn easy. <laughs> okay, so I got a stake. Now, I still have a stake on this one as well, so I'm assuming that one just came with it. But I did notice as well that the stake from the other shotgun disappeared. 
so maybe the stakes are one-time use, possibly? Let's take a look. Okay. Arroyo. Improve, uh, pump action shotgun improves quality, and then there's Efreets. A sniper rifle. We'll keep an eye out for the sniper rifle. I'm not going to buy it for now. I never like to buy weapons early on in a game because they're just going to they're just going to be flying through as I level up more and more and find new stuff. So just don't find the value in actually picking up any weapons right now. Briefing tables upstairs, it looks like. Hero customization. You just received a new stake. You can use to customize the look of your weapons. You can equip your new stake by pressing I to go to the loadout screen, selecting a weapon that has a stake attachment, and selecting weapon details. You can also change the overall look of a weapon by swapping to a different weapon skin you found. Finally, you can change your hero's outfit by selecting your hero in the loadout screen and choosing Customize Hero. As you explore Redfall and complete missions, you will discover more weapon skins, stakes, and outfits for your hero. Well, I'm playing solo, and I can't exactly see myself. I am just a floating head, apparently. So the whole skin change is kind of not worth it. So I'm not worried about that. Main missions, let's look. We've completed Dead in the Water. Next one is Two Birds, One Stone. The people hiding out in the Redfall Fire Station need supplies if they're going to survive. Guns, ammo, medicine, anything to help. A few stores downtown might have what they need, but keep your eyes and ears open for other opportunities. Don't know how all this started. Don't care. When we got here, things were already a hair shot of Halloween. Dead empty streets. Secret fires. Things creeping in the windows. Made contact on the second day. I got hit hard and drug off. Lights out. Woke up tasting blood with this freak ass bird in my grill. I'd just as soon be in hell with my back broke. But it ain't up to me. I can't go back to Bellwether. No one's coming to help these civilians. A few dozen of us tried getting off the island on that ferry. The damn bloodsuckers killed the sun and pushed back the ocean. Something out of the Bible. It's supposed to be a few places we can check for supplies. Ain't nothing left to do but cut out and grab some gear. Maybe save some idiots in the process. I'm done talking. Let's go. All right. Collect supplies for the fire station. That's our goal. Let's get out of here. Let's go do the thing. Map of Redfall. Use Redfall map to get the bearings and navigate the objectives. Press M to open up the map. From the map screen, you can see markers for your current objectives as well as other points of interest. You can also fast travel to any unlocked historical markers and safe houses or place pings to help you navigate or point out goals when playing with friends. Yep. That's what you get for flying in the sky when the sun is kind of half dead, man. I don't know. I don't make the rules. Searching those choppers could be the fastest way to find supplies. Oh, convenient. You're convenient. Crying out for me. I need you here. And you need me to be well. I have brought you down from the sky. I am the Hollow Man. The Hollow Man. Okay, let's... Let's take a look at the map. Helicopters are right there and right there. Let's go ahead and place pings. Yeah, let's go for that one first, I guess, because it's a little bit closer. I guess that's where we'll go. First, let me go ahead and try out the Raven. You mark some enemies, friend. Not yet. Oh, skill's not ready. All right, find your way. You explore. You will find many pathways through Redfall as you explore. To reach the the downed bell with their helicopters and an indirect route might be best. Use your map to drop your own markers to aid in navigation, or follow prominent landmarks like the down chopper's smoke plumes. Following the road east will bring you to the nearest historical marker, which you can use to fast travel and as a respawn point if you get into trouble. All right, noted. Uh, so how does this work? If I hold it down, it just holds the bird up like this. If I put it in this direction, you're gonna mark all three of them? Let's do some recon. Yeah, okay. So all the enemies here are now marked, it looks like. Let's just... All right. 
Well, that was easy. That was easy. Okay, so it said to follow the road east, which is an odd thing to do, considering we need to go west. But there is a historical thing over here, so let's go check it out. Don't want to get too away from the uh, the main objective here and actually just kind of keep things going for now so we can get some quick stuff going. Get established. Safe house found. Okay. Maybe we go clear it out. Maybe we go over there and say hello. Pop in. Knock a few vampires out, you know? Let's a go. So hearing lots of distant gunfire and explosions. Is this marked on the map for me? Okay, we need to go to that alleyway back there, I think, to actually get inside to the safe house. Ooh, Firebird. Automatic assault rifle. Okay, I don't know if you guys are going to see me this far away. But what I'm going to do here is we'll take off the handgun, put on the Firebird. Oh, look at that. Looks like maybe a G36. <laughs> the flare gun burns them out. That's great. That's good stuff right there. There is no escape. All clear. All right. Not bad, guys. Why are you glowing blue, though? Why are you glowing blue, men? You too. You're all glowing blue. Why? I mean, listen. I didn't want to take them out, but they looked at me. They looked at me funny. And they started getting all aggressive and talking smack. I couldn't have it, dude. Is this the alleyway I need to go in? Yes. Yes, it is. Looks like some kind of safe house. Good place to hunker down and stock up after we secure it. Some kind of vampire lookout. Okay. Now, what are these blue things? Are they like vampire souls? Safe house generator turn on. Let's do it. Nice little jingle there. Let me go grab this vampire soul thing. Not quite sure what it is, but it's mine now. Okay, well... <laughs> <laughs> that works for me. We got them. Let's go inside. This is Reverend Eva Crescente. Is any... Hey, this is Jacob. Safe house is up and running. You cleared out a safe house? Good on you. If it's not too much to ask, there's more you can do to help. My friends figured out some key places you can hit to bite back at those monsters. Anything you can do will make a difference. All right. Get out there. May the force be with you, Luke. Oh, we have some safe house missions as well. Triangulation. You picked up the faint enemy chatter through the radio. You need to track down the source and disable it along with any hostiles. I mean, we're here. May as well take the mission. May Might encounter it on the way on our way out somewhere, you know? Okay, let's go do these things. Let's uh go take out these antennas. The uh, antennae, if you will. All right. For science, I need to see if I can jump this barrier. I can. 
I like it. What did I just hear? It sounded like something honked at me. I guess it might have been a bird. Must have been the wind. Do I just... Nope. Okay. We have to actually get onto the rooftop to take them out. Or to activate them or deactivate them. Whatever it is that we need to do. Alright, we can't climb the telephone pole, guys. If I were... What is going on here? Well, I'm not going to engage you this far away because I don't know what else is up there with you. But there's just a vampire floating in the sky, so that's pretty ominous. Maybe we'll find rooftop access from inside somewhere. We need a rewire kit for this. I have a lockpick. Another shotgun. Alright, that door is unlocked. I do enjoy that you can just quickly loot everything. You don't even need to identify it. You just quickly loot. And if there's an item that you cannot pick up, it'll just, you know, still move you on to the next item. Which is pretty nice. I like that a lot. Alright, we're in the alleyway back here. I see some stairs. You might be able to get access to the rooftop right here. Yeah, there's an antennae over there. Oh, hello, friends. You can't hurt me. No hurting me. Oh, finally got hit. Honestly? Honestly? Owned. Honestly? Let's go ahead and heal up. Beautiful. That's better. Oh, you had a wedding ring on you. Well, that's cute. And that's why I didn't want to shoot the vampire from all the way down there, because I didn't know if the you know if the vampire was gonna have friends. Turns out they did. Alright, found another magazine for the AR. I did miss a lot of my spray with the AR at point blank range, but that's okay. I should have pulled out the shotgun instead of just spraying everywhere. Alright, rooftop access for this antenna right here. Triangulating? Get triangulated, nerd. Alright, the other one is right there. Looks like we just go to that stairwell over there to get up to that one. That one's easier. Oh my god, you can teleport real far, sir. Yeah, that shotgun's too damn good. That shotgun is too damn good right now. Alright, I don't think there, there's any fall damage, at least not from dropping a single story. Did you not have any friends over here, buddy? Oh, this one was all by itself. Poor guy. Wompy work whiskey. Wompy work. Oh, some sniper rifle ammo? Okay. You know what I could have done in order to make the, the first fight a little easier? Is if I just sent my raven out to identify them all. 
All right, disable the source of the signal. Oh, I see it over there. Or is that a safe house? All right, let's go over there. Let me place a ping right there. That might be it. I didn't actually see that yellow circle at first. Let's go. What's going on here? Are you frozen by the UV here? Yeah. Okay, so if we can use these UV lights to our advantage, they just kind of get locked up and we can just punch them and they break. That's kind of nice. Oh, the music just goes full ominous here. Gravelock. Gravelocks are scattered around. Oh, hold on. I'm sorry you got dragged down into this. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. Okay, grave locks are scattered around Redfall and hidden caches in hard to read, read, read hard to reach places. These psychic artifacts contain locks of hair taken from a mysterious figure connected to the vampire threat in Redfall. Collect them to hear echoes of her story and to earn bonuses to psychic residue regeneration. Okay. All right. Interesting. Someone's right there in the doorway. The cultists. D -d -d Double kill. Hold on, hold on. We gotta. There you go. Good job. All right, no one's behind the bar here. Now we're gonna go upstairs. There's likely gonna be someone that has an angle on me right away. They don't have an angle on me. Assassination? Yes. Rest and reload. I think we're good. Carpe Noctum. I hope you can hear this. Hollow Man's not a big fan of anyone else on his radio waves. Rat bastard. What Anna said. Anyway, All right, says so we have to take out an underboss. There's a lot of good work out there, but there's one more thing. There's a big vampire nasty out there keeping the neighborhood in line. Gotta kill him if you want to finish the job. Once you do that, the neighborhood can be safe again. All right, point me in the direction. I'll take care of them. Of course, maybe it'll be a mission at the safe house because it did offer me to return to the safe house. Let me just go ahead and make sure there's no other loot here and stuff. Use lockpick. Okay. Well, if we're using a lockpick for this room at the end of the mission, hopefully there's some loot in here. Ah, yes. Okay, so we need to make sure we have rewire kits for these safes. Yokai sniper rifle. Yeah, we found some good resources in here. Let's go ahead and use our rewire kit and see what's inside the box. Firebird. Badlands. And a whole bunch of ammo. And some jeweled eggs. Okay, let's take a look at this Firebird. The damage on it is 20, whereas the main ad has 33. But this does have the 30 round magazine. So. You know, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna stick with the main ad. It just hits harder. As long as I'm accurate, it's worth it. You know? As long as it's accurate, it's worth it. 
All right, we're done here. Let's go to the safe house. Hey. I'm going to buy another rewire kit. Just to have one on hand. Vampire underboss. Yes, you've eliminated most, almost every threat in the part of town. Now destroy the vampire underboss so the people of Redfall can take back the neighborhood. Let's go assault an underboss, shall we? I'm ready. Curity, curator gold. Burn your cheek, brain. Let's do it. Nothing. Come out. Don't you want to be something? I am something. Don't look this way. No. I wonder if I can sneak up on the boss and do some big damage. Uh, they must have spotted me. I was hoping to get a quick melee hit to see what kind of damage it would do to the boss, but uh, didn't work out. Also, the mark went away. All right, I'm going to see if I can launch this through the floor. Burn your cape, shithead. It does indeed go through the floor. There. No fear. No, thank you. This place ain't killed me yet. Now let's launch this this way and see if it spots anything. Make yourself useful. How am I doing on ammo? We're doing okay. We got another, like, four or five magazines. We're good. Where is the boss? It sounds like it's underneath me now. I can hear that, like, that distant, like, weird hissing noise that she was making. Go on, Bert. No? Where are you, curator? There's that thing again. I don't want to take those out yet. We got to figure that out. Oh, we got nothing. Where did the boss go to? Burn your cape, shithead. Uh-huh. And this thing is gone. I did see some stairs in the middle of the building. Let me go all the way up. Maybe this rooftop access. Are you on the roof? Let's 
do some recon. Someone is. There they are. Gotcha. Safe house mission completed. Rewards 1500 experience. Big. 